a ciao magia the pizza prosecco pasta prosciutto zero pace mario luigi this is super fancy <laughs> so hi magic people this video is going to be kind of a vlog a little update of what's been going on the past week so i went to italy over the weekend to go to a conference called Tabula Mentis, which is uh, for a group called Cycracy or Secrecy, depending on how you say things. It was a fantastic weekend and altogether looked a little bit like this. <laughs> That's why you get to be in it, you lucky girl. Who's a lucky girl? Who is Excited. Very nice bathroom. There it is, that's the B day. I'm gonna put my butt in there. We put butts in B days. So when you come to Italy, obviously you've got to try a local cuisine. That's which is why we come to Italy, isn't it? To eat Indian food in Italy with. I've not seen them before. No, they're amazing. It's really cool. I'm going straight for this spicy sauce. I think it's incredible. I don't even know what it is, but this is incredible. I have it. Yeah, I did it. Ha ha ha. Gin than I have ever seen in my entire life, and probably will ever see again. I can hear that. That bell is from the church next door, waking us up and letting us know that oh, it's on the hour. Just want you to see. just fucking finished ringing and now it's ringing again just in case you didn't hear it the first time Hi. day two and he's hurt himself already no card tricks for you tonight what What number gelato is this? Of today? Or of today? <laughs> Sunday morning and I'm being a very old man by having a coffee and a blanket on my lap. At the airport home and I get a massive slice of pizza. So I had an amazing time while I was out there and big thank you to everyone who came, who listened to my mini lecture. It was absolutely great to do. 
Uh, I now have more Italian friends, so I should probably learn proper Italian as opposed to the pizza per prosecco pasta, the, the, the peas, basically. If I can get out of the peas. Paella, that's Spanish. Fromage, that's French. I've done, I'm trying not to look one up. I'm genuinely trying to think of an Italian word that I know. Ciao bella. Ciao bella, ciao bella. Um, buongiorno. Sava, sava, trebia. No, French again. I give up. Anyway, <laughs> summary, I need to learn Italian. So I got back Monday and then Tuesday night I was at my local magic club, the Mid-Essex Magic Society, or MEMS for short, which was, so that was a good night. Wednesday I went with a good friend of mine to see a work in progress show by a guy called Neil Kelso. Uh, the show itself was called I Draw Clouds. It has really, really good things in it. Uh, I thought it was really good. Then Thursday and Friday, I was down at Alakazam Magic Limited. So for those who don't know, uh, Alakazam Magic is a publisher of magic tricks. And I was down there filming for a trick that I'm releasing called Charades. I'm not going to talk too much about that now because it's being released in the next couple of weeks. So there'll be some more stuff to say about that in the future. So that's everything that's been happening with me for the past week. Uh, I just want to touch on some things that have happened since I've released the uh, other videos. So the first video hasn't got much traction. Go watch it. My face off review was the first one that I was proud of. And so I put it up on Reddit. And a day later, I got a friend request from one of the guys at Illusionist. And I had a little panic because I thought, ah, crap, I'm about to get told to take this down. Thankfully, it was completely the opposite. They were really happy with the video. They thought it was really well balanced. So I was kind of happy with that. Since then, um, Lloyd Barnes has put up a message on the Reddit thread uh, addressing the video and just wanted to say his, his, his piece about it, um, such as the face off not appearing on their website. It was a site error and a little bit of backstory about it. And then a little while later, Benny Chikrin also commented saying he really liked the video <laughs> and said he's gonna be writing a post in the next week or so about his whole experience of what happened. And this was about six days ago. So I imagine fairly soon, if not now, there'll be a video, there'll be a blog post detailing out his experience with the companies if you're interested in keeping up with that. My other video, the Sankey versus Madison one, has had over 3,000 views, which I think is amazing. It's incredible. Thank you very much. And I do owe some of this to Daniel Madison, who commented and gave me angle zero, because obviously it is mine. I did create it first. Let's not, let's not fuck about here. So Daniel Madison, I, Daniel Madison, I take off my one pound sunglasses to you, sir. Thank you so much for your support. I hope you've subscribed. I don't know how to check. But no, genuinely, he's been a good sport about it, so thank you, Daniel. I've not heard from JS, aka Pinky, but I guess I can thank him for not filing a DCMA complaint. I don't know what that really means. I'm just kind of saying the words. Big thank you to everyone who subscribed so far. I didn't envisage getting over 150 with three videos, so thank you very much. Tell your friends and family to subscribe or horrible things will happen. No, I'm jigging. I'm kidding. So there are four more. So four, I've got a Christmas time video coming up to talk about some Christmas magic tricks. I've got a couple of reviews in the pipeline, but I don't want to put them out just yet. One, I'm double checking all the facts of before I actually go ahead with it. And the second, I'm actually getting the product in question. So I want to at least try it out in the real world before I can give an honest review or opinion on it. I have an opinion on it. And then I have another couple of ideas in the pipeline of things that I'd like to do. But if there is anything that you guys would like to see me do, please leave a comment down below. And thank you so much. Again, I don't really know how to end these videos. So I'm going to leave you with me making a mustachio. I mean, it really looks half-assed if I do it like that, doesn't it? I should cut these bits out. I, I, I should. I should. Oh, fuck. Why don't I just leave it alone? I'm probably just going to end up doing it like that, aren't I? Let's, let's face facts. It's the thing no one tells you getting into magic. Oh, do you like, do you like, 
using cards? Do you like using playing cards? No? Oh, <laughs> you're gonna do a lot of arts and crafts. I like playing cards, by the way. Sorry, just to say, just to... I'm looking at myself. I'm looking at the camera. I'm looking, oh shit. I almost stabbed myself. I mean, it looks a little bit better. Oh, do I actually wanna do the inside? This is, this is actually a lot more work than setting up bloody face off. And I could use that. Yeah, if it's it's for the wall. Oh, God. Stop waving that around. Come on, you moustache. Kids, don't play with sharp objects and intricate designs. Choose one or the other. I've not even started filming the fucking main video yet. Don't you fucking dare rip. Don't. Oh, shh. La, la, la. We're gonna be we're gonna be patching it up with a bit of sharpie, but come on, come on! Till I cut the fucking thing off. And... One end. Look at that. look. Look how much better that looks, Luigi. No, no, that's not real. Once I cut the, once I cut this bit off, you you'd have no idea. Well, you should poke out now. That's what the actor to the bishop. Oh well. Yes! Look at that. Look how professional that looks, right? You cannot buy that type of quality. I've lost the bits. I have found you. I should probably do this on some paper, shouldn't I? Oh, we did it. I can't really breathe, but we can do it. Yes! The pizza pasta prosecco. Oh wow, it's stuck. Oh amazing. Oh. That's good enough for an outro, isn't it?